What's going on, Imperials? Shiny Pokémon are always an exciting encounter. Collecting these rare creatures is a favorite pastime of many a Pokémon Master. Some Shiny Pokémon are good, and some are even great. In fact, there's so many, I had to double it. So, let's take a look at the top 12 Shiny Pokémon. Number 12. Beedrill? This might sound like a strange choice from a less than popular Pokémon, but I think Beedrill's Shiny is an excellent one. His original yellow turns to a striking green and his eyes a cool blue. Almost like a green hornet of sorts. Beedrill doesn't usually make it into anyone's favorite lists, but if he always looked like his shiny form, he might just show up more often. And besides, shiny Mega Beedrill looks seriously fierce. Number 11, Metagross. Metagross is one of the best Pokemon in everything, ever. He's easily in my top 6 of all time, and his shiny form takes his metal body to new extremes by plating him with precious metals. The reflective gold and silver color scheme works wonders in making this already beastly Pokemon even more intimidating. Unfortunately, I got my 3DS a little later than everyone else, and sadly I missed the event giveaway for the shiny Beldum. So, if anyone's got a spare laying around, I'd be willing to make you an offer. Number 10, Ninetales. Another silver entry. I promise they're not all this way. Ninetales' original look is a lovely majestic golden fox. The shiny inverts this by giving its fur a beautiful silver sheen. This shiny is so breathtaking that entire channels have been devoted to it. The tips of the tails are even blue, hinting at the likelihood of it having blue flames. Not to mention how it beautifully complements the shiny golden arcanine. Number 9, Vikavolt. Another notable bug type. Vikavolt was already one of the most fearsome looking regional bugs we've ever had. But add in his shiny colors, and he becomes a force to be reckoned with. He looks like he's wearing powerful armor that could shred through any enemy, and he almost looks like some kind of transformer. My cousin has one of these, and I'm very jealous because Vikavolt is by far the best shiny electric type I know. Number 8, Haxorus. Just when I thought pure dragon types couldn't be cool, Haxorus came along to prove me wrong. His design is threatening, and then his shiny form makes him even more menacing. Having Haxorus be completely black, besides the red highlights, shows the truly ferocious nature of this beast, giving a whole new meaning to the term sharp tooth. And with a fair amount of effort in black and white too, this Pokemon is one of only a very few guaranteed shinies in the game. Number 7, Aegislash. Shiny Honage is almost certainly rated R, being completely bathed in the blood of his enemies. The bloodstains carry all the way through the line, giving Aegislash a haunting feel. Eh? See what I did? His new black color scheme is augmented by the gold that truly makes him look worthy of royalty. And as a side note, I caught my first ever Honage in a luxury ball, just because, and have only ever caught Honage in them since. The colors go so perfectly together, it must be destiny. Number 6, Lycanroc. I know, I've talked about this one before, but look at it! It's a rock wolf, which is a cool thing to begin with, but then he becomes a striking blue color that makes him even more threatening on top of being the loyal companion. And you're probably tired of hearing about the similarities to Tiger, but look, Personally, having a shiny Lycanroc that I named Tiger brings to life a virtual crossover from my childhood that I never thought I'd see. But even without all that, this impressive canine more than solidifies his spot as a premier shiny Pokemon. Number 5, Golurk. If you couldn't tell from some other videos, I love Golurk. He's just so interesting being a forgotten sentinel of an ancient world powered by a mysterious energy. He looks great normally, but his shiny form takes it to a whole new level. His black and gray armor is perfectly accentuated with the green energy glowing from within. I spent many an hour in Dragon Spiral Tower in white version in the hopes that I'd be able to obtain one of these beauties. Number 4, Tyrantrum. 
Tyrantrum is the undisputed king of the fossil Pokémon. Every child has wanted a true T-Rex Pokémon since the beginning, so how could they make this Crimson Carnivore any cooler? By making him blue. In the past, they might have gone with a pink or a snot green, but ever since they moved to the 3DS, it seems like they've been making more of a conscious effort to have quality shinies. And Tyrantrum's cool blue color change makes him look incredible and keeps his foreboding demeanor. Number 3. Trevenant. There are a subset of shiny grass types that share a theme of autumn and that they turn darker colors to signify the changing of seasons. There are many good ones, but none do it better than Trevenant. All of his leaves turn a deep autumn color and his bark turns completely white. On top of the changing seasons, Trevenant gets extra points for becoming a dead tree, perfectly exemplifying his typing of grass ghost. I'm so pleased that this frightening forest spirit is one of the shinies in my collection. Number 2. Rayquaza Rayquaza is an extraordinary legendary and my favorite one from Hoenn. A giant serpent dragon that rules the sky is an exceptional member on any team, especially when it mega evolves. But its shiny form is one of the best examples of just changing the Pokémon to black and having it look amazing. The red and yellow highlights from the original carry over and seem to work even better than with the green. This look was so instantly classic that it influenced the pitiful shinies of the other two Hoenn mascots to copy him with their primal forms. There have been black shinies before and since, but the Regal Rayquaza undisputedly achieves it best. Number 1. Umbreon. This entry is sort of the opposite, with only the highlight colors being changed on the Pokémon. A common complaint amongst many shinies is that they aren't changed enough. It's a shame to miss on the sparkles and not be able to tell if the Pokémon is the right color or not. But Umbreon uses subtlety to its advantage by simply changing the yellow bands to blue. Seeing the yellow glowing in the dark would be mysterious enough, but the pale blue light piercing through the night would be just haunting. The change to the yellow eyes also really complements it and gives it more of a night vision feel. Umbreon is already my favorite evolution, but masterfully shifting the colors just a little bit makes this Pokemon stand out from the shadows with a truly shiny blue color, and I think makes it the best shiny in the game. So, those are some of my favorite shiny Pokemon. What shinies do you think are the best? Let me know down in the comments. Also be sure to leave a like, share this video, and subscribe so that you too can become an Imperial today. And we'll see you around next time!